Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to uh, polish your game. So let's go to create a C sharp script. Call it pause game. And open it up. And we're going to make a function for input. Call it. Oh, let me. Uh, zoom in for you guys. All right, it's all the way zoomed in. Void um, pause game, pause the game, because you can't use the same name as the class. And inside, we need to do an if statement. If input get key open parentheses key code and we'll do p dot p we have two open parentheses so we have to close both this statements have open and close brackets All right, and then to actually make it pause the game, I'm going to do time dot uh, time scale equals zero All right, and let's put our uh, function in the update function so we can use it for input. Alright, and let's run it. I haven't added it to the game. So drag your script onto um, the main camera, I guess. Push play, and you can see my person's moving. Jumping and shooting. So I'm about to push P. It's not moving at all. But you can still rotate somehow. All right. So I do that again and jump and push pause. You can see that it paused, but you can still rotate. All right, so how do we make them unpause? Actually, let me do this too, so you can see exactly what it's doing. All right, I'm going to push play and pause it, and go to the scene. You can see our character is pause in the air. He's not touching the ground. All right, so we need to unpause it. All right, let's just copy this, paste it, and put an else. If the I wonder if we can do like a combo. Key code and no. Let's just keep it simple and change the P to um, U for unpause. And let's set this back to one. Save it. All right, I'm going to jump. Go to the scene. We are 
not touching the ground. I'm going to push U and we fell back. That is how you unpause and pause your game. Now let's see if we can fix the uh, rotation problem. Not showing up. Uh, what? Using Unity standard assets. Oh, okay. I did not know that. So apparently, to uh, use the first person controller to get access to it, you have to type this. Okay, well, there you go. I figured that out. Now, in the await function, we need to call or use our reference my control equals game object dot find. Find uh, what the script is attached to, what game object is the script attached to, and type in a string, and let's go back. So right here, the script is attached to this object, so just copy the name of that object, which is FPS controller. And put your quotations and then dot get component you want to get access or the components or values of that script and then we're going to put the name of the script into here which is first person controller all right now we can uh, change values and stuff in this script from this script so all we got to do is go to pause game, and when we pause it, we don't want the character to move. So all we do is my control dot uh, hold on a second mouse look. Can we set this to public? Here we go, now it's popping up. I don't know why they would do that. All right, so we had to set mouse look to public. Oh, fuck. Right here, public, mouse look. That was private, so we couldn't see it. But now that it's public, we can see it and change the values in our Pulse script. So now, we can find the, something to do with it. sensitivity on the X. Yeah, that equals zero. And I 
Now this isn't necessary to do if you're not using this first person controller script. But since we're using it for the uh, example, I have to do this. All right, let's push play. All right, I'm going to jump and pause the game. All right. And now you can see we are not rotating around. I'm using the mouse and nothing is happening. You gotta push escape to get out of that. And push U to uh, unpause it. All right, so we need to fix this though when we land back. So all you gotta do is just copy this. Put it right here and set it back to whatever you had it. I think it was two. You can see we're rotating. I'm going to pause the game with P. I'm not rotating anymore. Push U to unlock it. And now I'm rotating. Alright guys, thanks for watching. And please subscribe, like, share the videos. Contact me if you have a problem or something. Thanks guys.